subscribing channel and press the bell icon for more videos. Hansel and Gretel Once upon a time, there lived a poor woodcutter, his wife and two children, Hansel and Gretel. Their mother died when they were young. Hansel and Gretel were very sad. Soon, their father remarried but their stepmother was very cruel. One day, she took the children deep into the forest and left them there. She was cruel, so their poor father could not do anything. Clever Hansel had some breadcrumbs in his pocket and had dropped them on the way so that they could find their way back home. Alas, the birds ate all the crumbs and they couldn't find the path that led back home. Hansel and Gretel went deeper and deeper into the forest. They were hungry and tired. Then came the cold night. There are not any stars or moon at the sky. Owls started to hoot. Everywhere was dark. Gretel was afraid and started to cry. She wanted to go home. Hansel took the sister's hand and hugged her. Don't afraid my little sister. Tomorrow we will find the way home. Our father will find and take us home. They were very tired. So soon both fell to asleep. Morning they woke up. It's very cold at the jungle and they were hungry. Hansel took the sister's hand and they started again to find the way to home. They walked and walked but could not find the way back home. Suddenly they saw a strange house made up of cookies, candies and chocolates. Look Hansel, a chocolate break! shouted Gretel in delight and both ate it hungrily. When they both were eating the yummy door, a woman opened the door. She was very old and also she had a very long pointed nose and had wear a pointed hat. Then she looked at the children and started to smile. You kid seems hungry. Get in. I will prepare you a delicious meal. She said. So the kids get to the house but they didn't know this woman is a witch. As soon as Hansel and Gretel get into the house, she locked the door. Then she caught Hansel and locked up in a cage. Gretel started to cry again. The witch wanted to bake Hansel and eat him. But she thought Hansel is not fat enough. So she started to cook delicious meals every day to the Hansel so he will get fat and then she can eat him. Poor Gretel had to cook every day. The witch had a poor sight. Every evening she went to the Hansel's cage, took Hansel's hand and touch his fingers to check Hansel is fat enough to bake. Clever Hansel give a stick to the witch every day when she is looking his fingers. So witch blame herself why this kid didn't get fatter and prepare new meals every day. But one day Hansel could not give the stick so the witch catch his fingers. Oh wow! Now you are fat. Today I can bake you and eat a very good meal. She said. She told Gretel to heat the oven. She would bake Hansel and eat them up. But just as the witch bent to check the oven's temperature, Gretel pushed her from behind and locked the oven door. You are very clever Gretel, shouted Hansel very happily. Gretel rescued Hansel and they filled their pockets with the witch's jewels. Finally, they managed to find their way back home. When they went home, their stepmother had died. Their father welcomed his kids with joy. Thanks to the clever children, the family was never poor and hungry again.